Hi and welcome back to MRTV. Today I have a very special unboxing for you. These are Snapchat's Spectacles 3. These are not VR glasses and these are also not really AR glasses. So what are they? <laughs> they are sunglasses with two cameras on them. Spectacles 1 and 2 only had one camera but now you have two cameras and this allows you to take photos and videos in 3D. And then you can send over these pictures and videos that you take from your spectacles to your smartphone and then on your smartphone you can apply the typical Snapchat filters and then you can send your videos and pictures around. Interesting and well these cost quite a lot in my opinion $380. So I believe these are yeah, a bit a tough sell for most of us, but still I'm happy to unbox them for you and I'm happy to show them to you. And all of this goodness is coming up. Hi and welcome back to MRTV. My name is Sebastian Ang and this channel is about all kind of devices that you can strap to your head. <laughs> like for example VR glasses or AR glasses or something in between or something totally different like the Spectacles 3. So if you are into that thing like putting stuff into your face then this channel is for you and you should absolutely subscribe to it and click on the bell button so you don't miss anything. Before we get to the unboxing of the Spectacles 3 I would like to say thank you to Big Apple Buddy who sent those over to me for review. Big Apple Buddy is a service in the US in New York who buys American products and sends them to people outside of the US who want to buy these products like for example the Spectacles 3 because these are not available in Europe. So if you want to buy something from the US you can go through their service, pay a little fee and then they're going to buy it for you and send it over to you. So check out their website at bigapplebuddy.com and check out all of the Black Friday deals because well there's lots of amazing Black Friday deals in the US that we in Europe don't have access to. And now let's get to the unboxing of the Spectacles 3. The Spectacles come in this black box and on the box it says Spectacles. Well, not very surprising. Let's get this open here. And here you can already see like the shape of the Spectacles. Let's get this off. And what you see here directly, this is the case. This is a very nice case. Let's open it as well. And first we got to pull this thing here off in order to get access to the spectacles. And here they are. Here are the Snapchat spectacles in the third version. They are being charged when they are in this case and this case is being charged itself via this USB-C port. Let's have a look at the spectacles now. As you can tell here the cameras are here and here so we have two cameras so of course we have this 3D effect which I'm going to tell you more about later. The whole frame is made out of metal and it feels like really high quality so it doesn't feel cheap well it better not feel cheap right for $380. Let me put that back and when you put it back there's a strong magnet which will pull it into place and charge it so this is very well done. I skipped the unboxing of the USB-C cable. I believe you have all seen a USB-C cable. Let's have a look at this here. This is more interesting because this is the Cardboard VR headset. Yes, Cardboard is back. Brought to you by Snapchat this time, not by Google. Yeah, the thing is exactly the same as we know it from the Google Cardboard. You open it and then you, yeah, you fold it a bit like this. And once you've folded this part, you have your VR headset. This is the part where the phone fits in and then you can see your pictures and your videos in 3D. Wow, unbelievable. I nearly forgot to show you something important <laughs> and this is these two buttons here. The buttons are on the right and on the left. Here you can see them and if you click them once the device is going to record for 10 seconds 
but you can always click again for another 10 seconds up to six times. And if you long press, then you're going to take a picture. Now what I do here, I try to make a picture, but it doesn't work because no energy left. But then I recharged them and then I took some videos and some pictures, as you can tell now. And you can see those videos and pictures in the Snapchat app because the spectacles, they will automatically sync the pictures and the videos to your smartphone and into the Snapchat app. If you want, you can activate the 3D viewing mode. Simply click on it and then you put your smartphone into the cardboard headset and you will see your video in beautiful 3D or you can see your picture in beautiful 3D and it really works nicely. People who don't know VR will be fascinated and for us who know VR, yeah, it's, it's nice, it's still nice. So then if you want, you can apply those typical Snapchat filters to your videos and because the videos have been taken in 3D with death, the app will know where are the walls and where is the floor. So it will then adjust its filters to your surroundings, which is pretty nice, but also really basic. So here you can see now the flowers, they are on the floor and on the wall. So yeah, it is actually not bad. However, it's also not so special. All right, so these are the spectacles in the third version. And how do I like them? I do like them. I think they look pretty cool. And I think it's a cool functionality that you can simply snap a video or a picture simply by clicking that button. And to have it in 3D is of course an added benefit. It's a cool feature that you can put your phone into this kind of cardboard VR headset and the 3D effect is really cool. Absolutely, I really like that. So, do I believe it's worth $380? <laughs> Probably no. $380 is quite expensive and I believe for most of us this would be too expensive. For those of you who have $380 just to spend and who, are, who always want to get the latest, yeah, why not? I think for you it might be interesting. However, I believe in the future, this has lots of potential. Spectacles 4, 5, 6, I believe they're going to be amazing. And Evan Spiegel, the CEO of Snapchat, he said that he understands that at this moment in time, probably the functionality is not so great because you actually cannot see um, the, the filters directly in, in, the, in the glasses, right? Now you have to apply those filters in the app, but Later, of course, I believe they want to go in that direction and it's nice that they're iterating year for year and every year it's gonna get better. So I believe they are on a really good way here with the spectacles. So how about the 3D effects here and the cardboard when you put your smartphone into it to have a look at your 3D pics and videos? It works really nice, absolutely. You have this death effect. You really feel like you were there exactly. Just what you, what you see in, in the cardboard is what you saw when you were taking the snap. So I really like this. It's a nice little gimmick. And for people who, who never tried VR, I, I think those people will kind of be totally fascinated by this. For us, as VR enthusiasts, it's nothing new, but for, yeah, for normal people, for normal people who did not yet get in touch with VR, they might be pretty fascinated by, by what this can achieve here. So would I buy them for $380? Probably no. If I was really rich, filthy rich, then yes, <laughs> but I'm not, so I wouldn't, I wouldn't pay that kind of money, but I can see that people are going to have fun with the spectacles in the third version. All right, this has been my unboxing and review video for the spectacles number three. I really hope that you enjoyed this footage and if you wanna buy these and if you're not in the US, you can go to bigapplebuddy.com and do also check their website because now they have all these Black Friday deals that people in the US can get but people outside of the US cannot get. If you do find something, then you can use code MRTV to get another $10 off. And that's it for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If yes, give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you have not yet subscribed to MRTV yet, do so now and click on the bell button so you don't miss anything. And I'm looking forward to see you in the next episode.